Good evening, I am the cinema fanatic, cinematic guru and overall crazy person. And today I'm going to delve into the insanity that is the French horror film, and what better film to start off with than Agroff the Mad Mutilator. <laughs> Basically, the French's answer to the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, but with more manic insanity than one could comprehend. The film was directed by video store owner slash fanzine writer Norbert Mautier, who also starred as the killer Agroff. It was the first film he ever made and was shot on 8mm film stock in 1983. The film is about the killer Agroff, a lumberjack who had been trepanated, which caused him to go insane. And for those of you who do not know what trepanation is, it's a form of surgery similar to this. Agroff spends most of his time killing random people, as well as their cars, chessboards, and chainsaws. He also eats human flesh, plays with toys, and does some other things. Weird things. Let's just say there's a scene in the movie which has to do with the naughty bits. Or more or less an axe substituted for the naughty bits. Thank you, John Cleese. Later in the movie, Agrav gets a girlfriend who shares in his interests. Things kick off rather well until Agrav's pet zombies show up to cause mayhem. The girl gets away but is later killed by a vampire priest and Agrav is axed to death by his zombies. Overall, the film is a complete mess, with no comprehensible plot whatsoever. The special effects are crude and badly executed, and the soundtrack is so jumbled you could swear it was schizophrenic. And I am not making that up. On several occasions, the music stops suddenly without fading out. And when a sound effect is edited in, all subsequent sound just stops. Also, the acting is cheesy and the actors are so wooden they make the trees in the background seem like professionals by comparison. Some acting lessons, you shithead. Everything about this movie is unprofessional, but it can be forgiven. Remember, this was Norbert Montier's first movie. A movie that got released in Europe and overseas here in America. I've been making movies for seven years, and I haven't had one released. And most of my movies are better than his. Oh, how I envy him. And now for my rating. 1 out of 5 for production value, and 3 out of 5 for ingenuity. Even though this film sucks, it's still entertaining in a so bad it's good way. So yeah, I'm the cinema fanatic torturing myself because you can't handle it. <laughs>